next. He's uh, probably the most famous person that you've probably never heard of. Alfie Dates has more than 5 million subscribers to his YouTube channel. It's called The Pointless Blog, a series of videos, well, about pointless everyday things. So we're going to try and do the backwards word challenge thing. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, we are. Gonna... And Grace has been saying how amazing she's going to be at doing I <laughs> yeah. am awful. Okay, I get to choose the word for you, then you get to choose words for me. Okay, great. Okay? Yeah. Is that an American word? Kebab. What's that? A kebab. That's, that's from Amer an American A kebab. About. Yeah, that's kind of horrific. A kebab. Uh, a what kebab? the hell is a kebab? Uh, he's now followed it up with a book, which went straight to the top of the bestseller charts. And on Saturday, 8,000 people mobbed him at a signing at the Excel Centre. He made it out just about alive and has joined me in the studio now. Thank you so much uh, for coming Thank in to you. join us. I do actually have a copy of, uh, of your book, The Pointless Book, which I can show to, uh, to a camera if they can see it. <laughs> um, so 8,000 people last yeah. weekend. That's not bad going, Alfie. It was crazy. Like, so, so mental. Did yeah. you expect it? I mean, you've got five million uh, subscribers to a YouTube channel. Well, because it's all online, like you see stats and figures and that, yeah. but you never know how many people are actually going to turn up. So obviously I expect maybe like a couple of hundred, but not 8,000, it was insane. Now you started all this pointless blog, vlogging yeah. when you were about 15 years old. Did you, why did you start it in the first place? I've always like watched YouTubers for maybe like seven or eight years now. And I've loved the obsession with getting to know somebody like that you wouldn't get to meet in person, but you can like know them online. You feel like you're friends with them. Yeah. And I just thought I'd try it out myself. And Did you yeah. ever think it would get this big and get this <laughs> no, far? <laughs> not at all, like, literally not at all. And at what point did you sort of sit up and think, oh my God, goodness, this is phenomenal. I'm like probably one of the most famous people online <laughs> at the moment. <laughs> at what point did you suddenly get that feeling? Um, that, I've never had the feeling, but it, it's kind of just like grown so gradually. I've been in okay. it for like five years now and there's never been like one video that blew up or anything. Yeah. So it's just... You say that, you said that you don't have that, that moment, but we've got on the screen at the moment, we're seeing all the girls that queued for you over the weekend. <laughs> so having 8,000 girls wait to, to yeah. you to sign their book, that it didn't give you that crazy. feeling of, of, oh my goodness, I'm quite of famous. Course, no, at the time, of course it does. And then you come, and now we're doing like TV yeah. now, and like, there's never time to relax and stop and think about it. Yeah. In the moment, I'm always like, whoa, this is insane. So, so many others have tried this and so many others have failed, but what is yeah. it about your blog that keeps it, that keeps going? I don't know. I don't know what it is about mine. I think people like YouTube and vlogging because it's just like, we're normal people. I'm not anybody special. I'm not a celebrity. I'm just like, like they are watching yeah. me, but I just happen to be on the other side of the screen. And I think yeah. that's what people like. It's just I'm normal. Well, so many um, other um, YouTube stars are crossing over to uh, to the mainstream. There's yeah. one here who's actually on ITV2, Dapper Laugh, to, who's yeah. uh, Daniel, who's from Clapham. Um, do you think you're going to make that move uh, over to, to the other side when we do this concern? <laughs> I, there, I haven't got like a particular interest. Like if the, if the right opportunity comes up, then maybe. Yeah. But I, I like it online because of the instant feedback. Because I can reply to comments, tweet them yeah. back. Have them come and meet me in person. And, like, but this is quite fingers. old media, this book. Yeah, like, Considering you've made your name on, online, yeah. why did you decide to go old media and do a book? Well, I thought, like, they're getting so much online, it'd be called for to give people, like, the viewers an opportunity to have something physical um, yeah. that, like, resembles who I am and stuff. So, so what next for Alfie, very quickly, then? I don't know. I don't know what's next. It's all changing so fast. Just okay. take it as it comes and have fun. Well, perhaps, you know, li a life story and Justin Bieber can play <laughs> or something. Oh, the irony. Well, thank you so much for coming in, Alfie.